The word pena is derived from the Latin word for penalty and has been used throughout history to refer to the punishment for an offense. In the context of Greek mythology, pena is often associated with the concept of justice and the idea that a person can only be punished for a crime if they have committed an offense. In Greek mythology, pena is often depicted as a form of divine punishment, meted out by the gods and goddesses to those who had angered or offended them. This punishment could take many forms, from physical afflictions and hardships to psychological torment and suffering. One of the most famous examples of pena in Greek mythology is the story of Prometheus, who was punished for stealing fire from the gods and giving it to humanity. As a result, he was chained to a rock, and each day an eagle would come and eat his liver, only for it to regenerate overnight. Another example of Pina in Greek mythology is the story of Tantalus, who was condemned to an eternity of torment in the underworld for serving the flesh of his own son at a banquet. This punishment was a form of Pina, a fitting retribution for Tantalus' heinous crime. The concept of Pina also played a central role in the Greek myth of Oedipus, who unknowingly killed his father and married his mother. When he discovered the truth of his actions, he blinded himself as a form of self-imposed punishment. In addition to its role in Greek mythology, the concept of Pina has also been a central theme in many religious and philosophical traditions. The idea of divine punishment for earthly transgressions and the concept of karmic retribution are common motifs in religious texts and teachings. In modern society, the concept of pena continues to be relevant and important, playing a central role in legal systems and ethical frameworks. The notion of accountability and retribution is a foundational aspect of the rule of law, and the concept of punishment for wrongdoing is a cornerstone of social order and stability.